Hey guys, Kaioken V2 here, and I'm going to show you guys how you can install the Pixel Utility side mod along with VLC Media Player and uh, making sure that we have the correct version of Java in order to run the Pixel Utilities side mod. Now, uh, first off, I'm going to go over a little bit of what Pixel Utilities is. So here is the wiki page on Pixel Mod Mod's website, uh, and as you can see, uh, it gives a, a brief explanation on each of the few items that it does add into the game. So uh, for the radio item in particular, you need to have VLC Media Player, which I will show you how to install. Uh, it adds in a slew of different things, including this Pixel Boy, which uh, is a Game Boy Color emulator. Um, now, these are all the items that it does add into the game, including uh, some different... Uh, Ores, including ruby, sapphire, amethyst, silicon, uh, and crystal. Uh, silicon's here. And uh, you can have mineral blocks uh, up to crystal. They do not have silicon blocks. Uh, and you can now craft items out of these new ores along with evolution stones. So if you do happen to collect a lot of evolution stones, you can now craft tools uh, and armor out of these. And these are the many different armors that they now have in game. They also have Team Magma Armor, Aqua Armor, Galactic Armor, Team Rocket Armor, Plasma Armor, Neo Plasma Armor, and all of the Evolution Stones that are currently in game. <clears throat> now, unfortunately, with the Dawnstone items here, it says the Dawnstone Armor exists, although it cannot be crafted from Dawn Stones. The armor can only be obtained by spawning it in. Uh, I will probably be adding these four items into a shop in the near future. It also adds some new badges, but we're probably not going to be using them. Also adds in some brand new achievements, some uh, commands for uh, admins and moderators, and that's basically what this mod does. It adds in a lot of really cool items. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. You can download it. There will be a direct link here on the Pixeldex website, pixeldex.org, and there will also be a link on the uh, bottom bar down below. So we go to download it, and I'm going to go to the desktop. There's already a file here, Pixel Utilities version 3.3.7. <clears throat> so basically, this is the easy part. It's basically installed as any other mod in Forge. So we're going to go over here, and uh, I have my .minecraft folder open. Now you're going to have to find out where your .minecraft folder is. Depending on your operating system, it could be different. So, uh, we're in our .minecraft folder, and this is where we, in where we would install the uh, Pixelmon mod. And in here, you can see there's Pixel Utilities. 3.3.7. You just drag and drop this jar file and make sure it is a jar file into here. And that's that basically is it as far as installing Pixel Utilities. Now, <clears throat> what you're going to really need to do is to check your Java version. Now, you can go on Java's main website, java.com, and go to do I have Java. Now you go over here and you verify your Java version. And we're going to go ahead and verify it and we're going to do that later and it's going to process the request. See I am currently running Java 7 which is not the latest version of Java, Java 8 it happens to be the latest version. Go ahead and click run. <clears throat> And this is a newer version of Java is available. Um, however, I am currently running Java 7. Now, it cur uh, currently, Pixel Utilities requires at least Java 7. Uh, I have seen it work with Java 8 uh, and up. Anything higher than Java 7 should be okay. So all you have to do is uh, download Java, install it, make sure everything works. There's that. Now we're going to go to the VLC media player, which is required for the radio item. Now what the radio item basically does in-game is that it 
allows for a user to enter in a direct link to an mp3 or any kind of music file and it will play it in game. So this item basically lets a user choose what music they want to be played through this radio. Now I haven't tested out the radio that much. Now it does say that you can choose a YouTube video via URL and have the audio play in game. Now I've personally tried a YouTube URL and it has not worked for me. It might work for you, you can try it yourself. Um, it, I've heard different stories where it working and not working for different people. Go ahead and try it out yourself. Here's the recipe for it. All the recipes for all the brand new items in this mod can be found on this website, which is linked right here. Now, we're going to go to the Video Land organization, which uh, releases VLC. Now, we need to get version at least one, uh, 2.1.5, excuse me, and we're going to go ahead and click that. Now, what you do need to know is what version or what bit system you have. And you can do this, uh, this is for Windows 8 users, uh, it can also work for any other version of Windows if you know what you're doing. Now, we're going to go down here to our file explorer, <clears throat> and we're going to uh, right click on this PC and click properties. Now here under properties, it will say system type right here. I have a 64 bit operating system. So we have that type of system. Now over here, in, if you can look uh, down here, when I hover over the link, it will say uh, getvideoland.org slash VLC, but it's downloading a 32 bit version. Now I want the 64 bit. Now, this is for Mac OS X, so if you have a Mac, go ahead and get this. This is for Windows. Now, I have the link down here for 32-bit as well as 64-bit. It's just as simple as changing a couple of numbers around. If you click on this direct link, it will send you to the 64-bit file that you need to install. So you go ahead and click it and it will take you to the 64-bit version of uh, VLC Media Player and it will go ahead and download it. I already have it installed so I'm not going to go through that. So this should be everything you need to do in order to make sure that Pixel Utilities works for your particular system. Now if you did happen to need to update your Java version you might have to restart your computer so you might want to go ahead and do that at this point. So I'm going to go ahead and get on Minecraft, and I'm going to go ahead and launch Forge, and show you that it works. <clears throat> now, at this stage, if it does happen to crash, and you have no idea why it crashed, please send me a message on uh, our website via pixeldex.org in a private message, and... Uh, copy and paste the error and I will try to work with you and uh, see what the problem is. So as Minecraft opens, and I'll also go ahead and test out the uh, radio feature here. So I'll actually go ahead and get a song ready and yeah, see I already have something here. I believe that this direct link should work. Okay, sorry about that. Now I'm going to copy that link. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm going to go into multiplayer and I'm going to connect to the Pixel Deck server. So if I join, then I definitely did everything correct. If I get rejected, then uh, I'm wrong. But I am right. So we are good. We are here. All right. So I'm going to go over here very slowly. Sorry. I have a very uh, slow processor. And I'm going to go over here and look for the radio. I'm going to take the radio, grab it. And 
place it on the ground. So now we have radio. And now, when you right click on the radio, you have the option for loop off, loop on, play and pause. And here goes the URL. So I'm going to paste in the URL that I had copied earlier. We're going to play it. <laughs> And as you get farther away from the radio, the volume does decrease. Unfortunately, there is no way to determine the uh, current volume. So you're going to have to deal with how it is here. Uh, I believe you can just actually just change the uh, music volume here and try to adjust it as you want. See, I have it at 100%, so... Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. This, is Ka uh, this has been Kaioken V2. Uh, I just wanted to show you how to install the Pixel Utilities. And uh, that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, comment them down into the uh, uh, bottom bar down here. And also, comment, rate, and subscribe to this channel. Uh, also, if you uh, have an error with this, have any other problems, Please feel free to private message me. I will work with you. Thank you for watching.